Is what Rico thinks is gonna happen to me when I jump into a black hole? Okay. Mm, I'm thinking that this is one of them wormholey black holes that's, you know, gonna take me to another parallel universe or something instead of rip me to shreds. I didn't say it would rip you to shreds. I said it would spaghettify you. Spaghettification is the process of being stretched by immense gravity until you're reduced to a thin stream of matter. That doesn't sound any better. Besides, I'm more of a fusilli guy. But if that's what it takes for you guys to subscribe to my channel, I'll do it. Subscribe. You are coming off as desperate. Yeah, whatever, all right. I'm about to jump into this black hole for just one nanosecond. Can I travel to a parallel universe before I get pulled back out? You never said anything about pulling you out. That would be impossible. What? The black hole's gravity pulls so hard that no amount of force is able to pull you out. Rico! You'll be stuck moving toward the center no matter what. Oh, come on! Oh! Oh! Ah! Oh, oh man, I'm not starting to... Oh. Oh, I'm starting to not feel so good. Oh. You're starting to move in slow motion, even if time still feels normal to you. This is because the strong gravitational field near the black hole slows down time relative to an observer far away, a concept known as time dilation. That's not how Nolan did it in Interstellar. Uh, uh? Yes! I told you that would work, Rico! Never doubt your boy Chase! Uh, oh. Just like I suspected, the black hole was actually a tunnel through space-time, a wormhole, as the science nerds call it. And the other end has dropped me into a parallel universe, instead of crushing me like Rico said it would. I'm a genius. Don't celebrate too much yet. Huh? sake! Even in a parallel universe, everything's out to kill me. This isn't the universe where you survive at the end of every episode. Wait, what? You mean that exists? No, that's not what I meant. Oh, well, of course! Why didn't I think of that? Theoretically, there are countless parallel universes where every possible outcome of every event happens. So all I need to do is keep jumping from universe to universe until I find one where I don't die at the end of every episode. We're in purely speculative territory now. It can't be that simple. Watch me, Rico. Maybe I can find a universe where I don't die, and my YouTube channel is hugely popular. <sighs> oh, hey, that's looking better. Uh, yeah, that's not happening. Let's try again. <sighs> uh, hello? Are you guys real? Uh? I didn't sign up for this! Ah! Huh? You see that vicious jealousy in chimpanzees? One of the things they attack no. people over is un- Okay. Mr. 
getting weird. All right. Huh. Everything seems pretty normal. Hey, what's up, broskies? So today, I'm gonna like be doing the train prank. Where I'm gonna set up 400 mannequins, and you're gonna see which one of us gets hit by the train first. It's gonna be epic. Holy crap! Rico! It's me! It's, it's me! Oh. Hey, what's up, broskies? So today, I'm gonna... Oh, man. Is that what I look like? Yes, he is an exact match. Except he has 5% less body fat, 13% more symmetrical facial features. Yeah, okay, okay, I get it. Thank you very much for being very explicit. Probably land on the moon. Go um, whoa. Uh, I'll probably land on the moon, or maybe I'll end up in orbit. I love you. I love you guys too. Yeah, totally. Oh, let's take a photo. Yeah, yeah. No, I'd love to do more selfies. Okay, don't touch me. Man. All right. Okay. All right. Chill. 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 Yo, chase heads. Chill. Ah. Oh, good. What are those things? Subscribers. Huh? He has 500 million of them. What? Dudes, that was totally a prank! <laughs> I'm still chilling. Hello! Catchphrase! What am I watching here? It's a prank! I'm just kidding, you idiots! <laughs> Why are you all screaming, bro? Listen up, Rico boy. Chase here can definitely jump into this black hole. So that's what I did. I jumped in and spaghettified while fulfilling myself all the way here. And somewhere between all this, I was on Joe Rogan. Somebody wanted me to eat a bunch of hot dogs. And now I'm here. So, like, no matter what sick tech or rad gear you roll in with, you still totally bite it at the end of every episode? That's what you took away from this? I mean, I know it's lame, but like, no, bro, that's epic. I mean, you might bite it at the end of every episode, but at least you come back <laughs> smelling minty fresh as ever. Me? I just never die, no matter how wrecked or busted up I get. But you're living the dream. You've got your face on billboards. You've got mobs of crazy fans who love you or want to eat you. I'm not really sure what was happening over there, but it seemed cool. Bro, they're crazy. Like, they keep pushing me for gnarlier and crazier stunts. Now they've got my sponsor, Red Bull. Red Bull gives you wings. Hopped up on this massive live stream. I don't think my body's gonna come out in one piece, bro.
<sighs> Dude. They want you to go into that? Yeah, and I mean, like, I want to, and like, my agent's saying that it could slide me into more sciencey videos, and that's where the big bucks are, man. <laughs> but dude, if I go in there, I know I'll be stuck in there forever, just getting stretched for all eternity. I'm no superhero, not like you, bro. <laughs> I'm no superhero. Where am I? I've got an idea. I'm gonna get in your pants. What? <laughs> Bro, I don't think anyone's gonna believe that's me. That suit's way too tight, you can barely move, bro! That's because he has 5% more body fat than you. Yes, you had mentioned that already. Thank you, Rico. Wait, did you build this spacecraft? Yeah, bro, why? Yeah, that's not gonna cut it. Cue the montage. Right now. Start it! Okay, so, if you flew a regular old spaceship into a black hole, it'd be a pretty short live stream. The gravity pulling on the part of the ship closest to the black hole is much stronger than the gravity pulling on the back of the ship. So, it'd be ripped in half long before you reach the center of the black hole. You'd also be bombarded from the intense amounts of radiation escaping from the hole, which would not only disable the spaceship's systems, but also melt your face off. Luckily, the uh, spaceship I've built for you can withstand all that, but the technology required to do so is too complex for puny human brains to understand, so it won't actually be you flying the ship. It'll be me, dressed as you. You just wait here until I go into the black hole. And then you reemerge with everyone thinking you just pulled off the most amazing feat in the history of the universe. Even though it was me and I've technically done it a few times now. And then you'll have all the credibility you need to start that science channel you've always wanted. You really think you can fool all my fans, bro? Uh, yar, bro, I think I got it, dude. Uh, I might need a new suit though. What's up, yours? It's your boy Chase, still alive. Oh, oh, thanks, Slim Jimmy! <laughs> You're my bro from another mirror! You might want to tone it down a bit. Besides, you still have time to change your mind. I thought this universe was everything you wanted. Uh, yeah, I think I'd rather have my small group of real supporters than these 500 million monsters. I miss you guys. You're the best, really. Remember? When we went to the moon and I made that hamburger that you guys watched me choke to death on? <laughs> you guys were there with me every step of the way. Plus, you know, I'm starting to think that my dying thing is some kind of superpower. 
Should I get a suit? Like a, like a super suit? Wow, that really went to your head. I don't know what you mean. Here we go, bros! Grab your Red Bulls and crush them on your face in two, one! Chase anywhere? Huh? Uh, wait. How did we end up right back where we started? What are you talking about? You know, the parallel universes, the other chase, the live stream, the Joe Rogan experience. You don't remember any of this? No. As soon as you entered the black hole, you were immediately spaghettified to death. And now, you are here. No. No. There's, there's no way I imagined all that. Rico, check your hard drives or something. We traveled several very different universes. We jumped in like five black holes. The concept of traveling to a parallel universe through a black hole is extremely unlikely. Even if it was possible, the odds of you passing through the event horizon before dying are very, 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 very low. But not impossible for someone with superpowers. Oh no, dude! Oh, it's just a prank, bro! Stop being so dead about it! 